Another useful technique in bucking, when you have to remove a section of a log and you're going to have to have crew members or yourself roll it out, is to change the angle of your cut slightly. If you cut both angles at 90 degrees, chances are as it starts to pivot, it's going to bind. If you line up to start your cut and then change to an angle like this, make this cut, come down over here, do the same thing, it's an angular cut, you'll find that as the section drops and starts to move, your kerf opens up and allows for an easy movement of the piece of material. You can see as the section dropped, our kerfs opened up real wide, and now it's easy to roll the section out. You'll notice that when I was bucking this log, that I dropped down and put my bar parallel to the ground and only cut till I got to the bark. And this is to protect my chain from getting in the dirt and dulling my chain. If you stand up like this and you can't see your tip, it's difficult at times to keep from getting your chain in the dirt and dulling your chain. So a technique is to get parallel when you have room underneath and only cut to the bark. This will preserve your chain for when you need it in harder cutting situations.